Hello, everybody. It is um, the creator of the Night Star crew. Uh, well, not creator, but the owner. Um, and the actor of Night Star, Freddy. And I am here to give all of you a bit of an update. So, as you may or may not have noticed, um, the Night Star crew has been a little bit off in the last few days. So, um, what would probably cause people to think is the series over, is it cancelled, is something happening, like, you know. And I'm here to answer all your questions, so... Uh, before this, we start getting this on, um, I just wanted to say, don't, if I sound different, I am not feeling well, I'm actually sick right now. I'm, uh, taking a bit of a break from, um, recording things, working on things, because my mind has been overwhelmed with lots of things over the past couple of months and has caused me to make some very rash decisions. Um, so yeah, uh, if you don't see any uploads from here for a bit or anywhere involving me, that will explain why. I'm taking a bit of a break and I should be back by like next month or maybe in about like a week or two. So whenever my mind settles. But enough of me. I started Crew's second recorder, known as Andrew. Um, me and him had a bit of a, a bit of an altercation. Not nothing too bad, but it's like when we had a disagreement. Um, kind of led to Andrew stepping down and leaving the Night Star Crew. Um. Um. No, it's not, it's not his fault. I don't want people to think that this is all Andrew's fault. The reason that things like this happen, it's not Andrew's fault. Like I mentioned before, uh, my mind got overwhelmed with many things and I made some rash decisions. Mainly, I'd say it's my fault. Uh, I made a decision that kind of he didn't, you know, want to go with. And what led to the decision, I said a couple things that maybe could have been reworded a bit. Could have been um, said a bit better, and you know, so that's on all of me. So if anyone deserves to be like, "Oh man, you you, you did this," it's like I kind of deserve it. Um, not him; he doesn't deserve any of that. Um, yeah, you know, he he left and. Uh, the playlist for the Night Star crew is still there. Y'all can still watch um, that stuff. And I know you guys are probably wondering. The next question is the Night Star crew ending. Is this channel just completely dead now? No, no, it's not. Um, so when me and Andrew had our bit of an altercation, uh, mainly what it was was uh, me and some of the cast, not most of them, but the cast, uh, we just weren't happy um, with the direction of the series, and take take no mistakes or you know don't take this the wrong way, but we just weren't happy with the direction of the series. Um, I know what you're thinking. Uh, you're the owner. Why would you be unhappy? But you could just fix it, you know? Um, no. So, I let, uh, Andrew, uh, take control and do everything. Because, like I said, my mind was overwhelmed. And I felt like I couldn't do anything. So, I let Andrew do it. Um, in hopes of helping him get back his motivation to do his, uh, his stuff again. Because I really wanted to see Andrew... Go back to working on series again. So I let him control the story and all that stuff. Well, I took the time to 
readjust, let's say. And it didn't work. In the end, it just didn't work. Um, and in the end, I came out and discussed my issue with the series. And I wasn't happy with it. I wasn't happy with the direction of it. I don't know, like, to me, the series, like, it's not Hendrick's fault. But he tried his best. He did everything he literally could. Um, he was doing what he, you know, what he felt was a good idea. And, you know, like I said, I just wasn't agreeing with the direction. But I just didn't say anything. Because, like I said, I wanted him to get his motivation back. And I didn't want to kill everyone's mood because of my um which I just didn't like so I didn't say anything um but yeah that, that the whole uh, thing was I didn't like the FNAF 1 location I didn't like how we just kind of started off in a FNAF 1 location but that was really small like that could have been easily fixed with this uh Another thing, I just didn't like the double recording. It's like two recording areas. It was a cool idea. I, I gave Andrew props. It was a really cool idea. Um, but I felt like there was many times where we could have recorded and many people just didn't show up. And it kind of just had to cancel recording, which kind of made people upset. So that's why I was like, why don't we just make it so we only have one recorder and um, it's the second recording. So that was another thing. It was it was it was a lot of things. Uh, like I said, they weren't that big, like too much of a problem causer. But in the end, you know, I feel like Andrew took it maybe a bit the wrong way, and he kind of you know, um, probably in his mind he was thinking he probably should have said this earlier. Um, but yeah. So yeah, like I said, don't don't, don't hate Andrew because he did nothing wrong, literally nothing wrong. Uh, it's not his fault on any levels. It's not his fault for taking over. It's not his fault for doing any of that stuff. I I let him. I let him do all that to help him get his motivation back to do what he's planning on currently doing now. Uh, so I can at least say I, I at least could say at least there was some point of a win in that. As for the Night Star crew, it is the plot is changing as from the side where Andrew was in it. Um, because I was hoping he would say like I didn't want him to leave. I didn't want him to leave, but you know I understand. If he wanted to step down, you know he could step down. Um, but yeah, uh, the plot is only changing as far as the human side goes. We're still going to take the same direction that we were going in. Uh, I just changed up the location a bit. Well, not even a bit. I changed up the location. What hit me? Oh, I changed up the location a lot, actually. <laughs> a whole new location. I'm. Mm, some people might not be happy with it. Some people might be happy with it. We don't know. We, <laughs> We don't know. We'll have to see. But, um... Yeah, and it's just gonna be called the Nightstar Location. Kind of more like Sister Location. Um, where it's just all, like, variations of Nightstar animatronics. And a pizzeria. Um, instead of, like, having the originals and stuff like that. I just wanted to take their direction out of the... Um... FNAF regular animatronics. And I was just thinking, like, if you were going to do that, why don't you just make your own, like, custom-made series? And I would. Trust me, I 100% would. But, um, I don't know if that's something you guys would want me to do. Um, because, again, I've had past, I've had issues in the past when it came to creating custom series. I just I flop. I just don't know what to do with them. I would be horrible. I was a horrible storyteller when I was <laughs> getting used to YouTube. Um, I'd say I'm okay, decent now. But I'll leave it up to you guys. If you guys want me to... Uh, I'll leave it up to everyone in the comments. Uh, if you guys think I should probably continue with the Night Stars. 
uh, we can do that, or if you think I should make my own fan-made custom series, whereas, you know, it's something different outside of just using the regular FNAF characters, and it's like my own characters, my own story, I could kind of take a change, I could take a direction like that, I don't know, whatever you guys want to see. Whatever y'all want to see, I can give it a shot. Uh, but yeah, the series is on a bit of a hiatus for like about a week or two. Get back to normal programming and stuff like that. Hopefully, I would say hopefully. Uh, I would want Andrew to come back. I wouldn't want him to, wouldn't want nothing to be between us, like no beef or anything. Uh, I would want to still work with him because he was a, he's a friend of mine. Uh, helped me with a lot of my problems and stuff. Like, personally, not just roleplay-wise. So, you know, if there was ever a chance for him to, like, come back and join us, would take that opportunity any day. Uh, but like I said, you know... Oh, boy. Like I said, anyway... <laughs> but that's so great. I don't feel that. But, um... If that's not, like, an opportunity... Opportun I can't speak! If that's not a chance of that happening, then that's okay. Uh, but yeah, what do you what do you guys want me to do? You guys think I should do my own thing? Should I continue and find something different with the Night Stars? Because if either way, I feel like it'll be something new and different for us. Um, you guys want us? Like I said, everyone loves the Night Star crew, you know. But like I said, if you guys want me to change, if you guys think I should change something up, think I should do my own thing, let me know. I'm open to literally any ideas at this point. Um, just based off your response to what you guys want to see will be the fate of this channel, basically. If you want me to continue Night Stars? Just say, ah. Uh, if, you, if you want me to continue the Night Stars, just say continue the Night Stars. If you want me to... Do a new custom series and change that into this. And then you just said custom series and me and my crew will get to work on it. But yeah, Andrew, if you're watching this, uh, all I want you to get out of this is I'm sorry uh, for what happened. You know, whether things were taken out of context or I really was just being a butt. Apologize for that. I uh, hope somewhere down the road you can either come back or we can work as partners, as friends again. Like I said, uh, never know. The world's a mysterious place and you just never know what can happen next. Yeah. Um, I might be working on things on the light, on the, you know, like I might lay low and work on a few things uh, as I am taking my break from just recording and working on things, but I might work on some things. I don't know, we'll see what people in this video say. It'll depend on if I work on anything at all. Uh, but yeah. I just want to say thank you to everybody from the Night Star crew, every member, Andrew, Kiwi, Nora, Lemon, uh, Sander, Secret, all the, all the members. Thank you guys for, uh, sticking through. Um, and helping me, you know, create this series. Because literally without all of them, this series would have never happened. It would have never have been as big as it was. Because, I mean, man, guys, we almost hit, like, 100 subscribers in, like, a short span of time with this series. So that's kind of crazy. Um, like, just, yeah, thank you. You know, it's all the thumbnail artists, the actors, everybody. It's just, thank you. I never thought, like, a series I would do would become this likable. Uh, it's, it's insane. I thank you guys for helping me on that point of really just looking at it as I am able to do more. I give myself credit for. Um, so thank you. And that's about it. Like I said, don't send hate to anyone. Not Andrew. Especially not answer. It's nobody. Don't hate anyone. Okay, if you gotta hate someone, hate me. Alright, because I did this. I caused all this. I'm not gonna hide it. I'm not gonna say I didn't do it. I, I caused this. So, um, yeah. 
like I said, I'm sorry to the main person I caused this to. Uh, I hope somewhere down the road we can reunite or something. Oh boy, I messed up. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah, there's about three of them. <laughs> but yeah, uh, that's going to be the end of this. This is just a little update video. It probably went on a little too long. Um, and with that, I will see you all uh, when, we, when we record again. Uh, like I said, we should be back in like a week or two. Somewhere around there, hopefully. Uh, but we're not ending. We're not going anywhere. We're still going to be working on something, at least. So, yeah, stay tuned, and thanks for sticking with me. Appreciate all you guys. Peace out.